Thank you. We want to know what the hell. No. Shh. 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 We have fully cooperated with the police since September 11th when they called. I did not say that I saw my brother. I said I haven't been able to speak to him in reference to the time when I was called by the police. Since that point, I haven't been able to speak to my brother. I have been honest. What happened? And like, I don't just, know just, what happened. Yeah. The I, thing about it is we know Gabby's family. Gabby is... We do too. What do you want us to do? We cooperate with the police. We're not supposed to talk to anybody, and you're making my children cry. We're, we're, was Brian with you on September 1st? Did he come to this house? Yes, he yes. came to this house with my parents in their Mustang, not the van. I did not know that he took that van back. I found out the next day with everybody else. We are just as upset, frustrated, and heartbroken as everybody else. And I am losing my parents and my brother and my ch children's aunt and my future sister-in-law on top of this. And you're not helping Why your parents? Why, why your parents? You're talking about Christmas. they're not talking to us either. Why aren't they talking to you guys? If I knew, I would say, I don't know. Do you think they're involved, your parents? I don't know. You don't know? We know. You're not involved? We have literally been finding everything out with the news with like everybody else. My kids are upset. You're upsetting my neighbors and all we want to do is let you guys know that we don't know. What happened? What, what did nothing. you guys do on the 6th through the 8th? At Fort DeSoto. We were at Fort DeSoto on the 6th. We got there at around 2 o'clock, and we left around 8 because the kids had school the next day. On the 6th? On the 6th. We only stayed for about six hours. We Who was there? My mom, my dad, my brother. Would you and guys be willing to go on, on record to say that you would like your have. brother Brian the FBI knows all this. They've known to this turn sense. himself over what, to the what, authority? What was going on at Fort DeSoto Campground? What were you guys doing there? Like, were they where there was a campfire? Yeah. We were, yeah, we had s'mores. We had dinner. What did Brian say anything about Gabby? We had our kids there. Nothing came up. He didn't say anything about Gabby. No, we've told we the were, FBI everything. We were, did everything Brian go? Did you? The world does not need to know what the FBI knows, that's and true. that's why we're silent. They have asked us to not say anything. Really. This is me coming out against them. They're suffering. They we're time. suffering. <laughs> well, they're suffering. To be fair, I they understand lost your life. view. I mean, to 100%. be fair, they lost life. So I know. I, I, I really I feel too. bad for you, but again, I don't no, feel bad I for you. No, I know. That's fine. You feel how so, you feel. We help how we feel. My kids are upset. You're upsetting my children, who are very upset that they had to find out that their aunt died from you people screaming it at them from the house. So that's not where. Fair. Where was that at? On well, Saturday, Saturday when you were here. Your aunt died. No, their aunt. Their, their aunt. aunt died. Yeah. Yes, the future aunt. Yeah, they considered her aunt, Aunt Gabby, forever. So. To be, to be honest with you we can't even hear you inside well, we can't we i mean <laughs> so where, where else have you seen brian since That's since september it. 1st i have not september seen 6th. anybody after eight o'clock on september 6th i have not spoken to my parents how long did they stay there do you know like at the, at the know. fort DeSoto soto did brian go off on his own into the woods or anything? we don't well, we've know we've been told we know as much as you did you so when he came here september 1st right you said mm -hmm. he came what, what did he come here for so. My parents wanted to surprise the kids to pick them up at school. I did not know that Brian was with them when we had previously planned to hang out with them. This is not what we want to be doing. This is not how we want the world to find out when we're angry and upset. But I can't have my kids be crying for three days in a row. What did the FBI take out of the house here? Like what? Nothing. They came here though. They, yes. During, during. We met with them multiple times. You met with them multiple times. Yeah. Did they ask you for like polygraphs or anything like that? No, but no. We're not. We don't know. We're not involved in this at all. He's my brother we're and like that's the parents. It. Are... The parents. We've been outside the parents' home for two weeks straight. I know. I've been There's, watching there... where our summer vacation was hanging out with their yeah, friends. It's 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 a tough situation, and 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 I'm hearing you, and I I, I appreciate you guys coming out and talking. Yeah, we 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 do respect that, we're and that's why. Not save our neighbors. Yeah. And you know this. You know, again, if no one, I don't think anyone would have ever came to your house no, until you know, the media came out and said, well, the she. The media said that, and my parents' lawyer really screwed me over by saying that he just Well, I saw by. the comment that he, he made. He did not he... just stop by on the way home, and I was livid, and I'm not speaking to anybody. Yeah, no. I'm done. Because that put me in danger. That made my kids find out this horrible way with questions. Yeah. We were waiting until there was some kind of closure, so the kids were just sad. Instead of sad, worried, and now really scared of you guys. Well, based off all the stuff on the internet, do you think Brian killed Gabby? I don't know. The internet is the internet. understand. If you had anything to say to Gabby's family, what would you say? 
has already reached out through the FBI to them. So. Yeah, I've already spoken. I mean, I know, I know the family personally, and I can share this. What do you have to say to Gabby's family? I don't have anything to say right now because the police has told us specifically not to talk, not not to, talk, to, to, talk to anybody or anything. And she's going outside of that talking to you. Yeah. So sure we'll you have to respect Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're going to get As long as you didn't say anything that you didn't tell them. <laughs> no, they know so, everything. 100% honesty, September yeah. 11th, night forward. We've been cooperative. They've it's just over. frustrating met them. The uh-huh. family's upset because they're not getting the belongings from Gabby that are in your parents' home. We have no idea what they have they, or they don't won't have. Get, they won't yeah. give them. I don't know. The parents have hung up the phone on them. I mean, it's just frustrating, you know? I'd also like to say that, not to um, upset Mr. Petito any further, but I did not get any phone calls from him in the days prior to the September 11th. September 11th, I've checked my phone records. I don't see any. He maybe had the wrong number for me. So I was not ignoring his phone calls. Right. I didn't get them. The right. first one was from the... And that could have happened. County. He could have yeah. had the wrong phone. It was very easy. So... so we called them right back. It doesn't, you know... It's just, sad. It's just view, a sad situation. It's just it's sad. You know, I don't know what sure. to think, but I appreciate you guys coming out. Yeah, And uh, I do appreciate you coming out. I don't know what to think. I do yeah, something. You know... Yeah, to us, the silence was like a form of guilt. You understand? Oh, yes. Like, I understand. But us, for us, silence was not guilt. Silence was well, the nobody FBI telling us not the to. Lie yes, was the I know. And, you so, know, and plenty of people here, but... <laughs> oh, they, they have come by? Yeah. No. Yeah. But there's just there's just, just people upset, and they just want answers. They want Brian because he's on the loose. Trust me, I understand. Whether he's dead or alive, he's out there. The sooner he is found, the sooner yeah. this is over for us. Yes. We can mm-hmm. start to and that's what we keep trying to express to your parents. Is that if we, if they can just come out and just start cooperating, I'm making a statement. Making a statement, I know. we will go away. I've been I mean, we have to. We we are here. Same. Parents home for two weeks straight. I know. I've been there's, watching. There's 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 people out there. They want. They I feel your family's involved. A cloud of suspicion. Yeah. The reason why we're here for of you course, is because the media, the media, the media, the media ended up misconstruing what I said when they asked me if I had seen my brother. Like I said in the beginning, they didn't say. Have you seen Brian? It was, what's the weirdest thing about this all? It was, I haven't been able to speak to my brother. I tried to contact him after this. I tried to contact my family after this. I hadn't been able to speak to my brother. Do you know about any additional burner phones? I have no idea. So you don't know nothing? No. He's my brother that I don't talk to that much. And the parents ain't talking to you? Your own parents are not talking to you for what reason? They just... The lawyer said not. Who's the lawyer? Their their parents' lawyer. Their lawyers? We We have nothing to hide. We were told not to talk to anybody, and I'm upset that we have to come out and do this and then explain myself to the FBI. So, so. W- when Gabby was missing, the parents uh, weren't even looking for her. They weren't even out looking for her. We don't even know what they knew. We can do assume. you know that she was missing when they went to Fort DeSoto? No. no. You didn't have no clue 11, that she was missing? The detective that was working with Gabby's mom called me up while we were on vacation. We were in Orlando. And then I called her back because we were eating dinner and I told her everything she needs to know. We told them from day one that we were at Fort DeSoto with them on the 6th and that they came over here on the 1st. The police has known everything that's out there the whole time from September 11th night on. That's when I became involved and I knew nothing before that. Any other questions? So what were your thoughts after you found out she was missing and your brother was here by himself and in her van and ran up $1,000 on her credit card? These are card. things we're not allowed to answer. Have you ever seen Brian hit Gabby? No. Have you ever seen him fight? No. Have you ever seen him hit any woman? No, woman? I've never seen him be <clears throat> abusive or right angry in you, anything. No. You know no. that we talk to neighbors. We canvass camp- camp- your parents' neighborhood. Yeah. They've heard screams coming out of your parents' house many mul- on multiple occasions. Your parents' house. Okay. Screams. I don't know what to tell you about that. I've been our kids. We lived there for... A year. Oh, you lived at the uh, at yeah. the home in Wabasso? Yeah, Gabby and Brian lived with us. When they were in New York. And you've never seen a fight? No argue? No. Of course, you know, we bicker. But nothing. Everybody bickers, but nothing like what any, like, no so domestic anything. they have a domestic violence. No, no, yes, or else we would have done something about it. Right. Like, I don't stand for that. I was in a bad relationship similar to that. what's saying has happened. I wouldn't let that happen. We're... Not, not evil monsters, we're made out to be a lot of people just want answers there's a cloud of suspicion nobody 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 came to your house i'm sure to after it came out in the media they said oh you lied they said that you misled the saying that you didn't see him 
I didn't say that I didn't see him. I said I didn't speak to him after that question was like, what was the weirdest thing that I haven't been able to talk to my brother? As in from the 11th forward, I have not been able so to talk to my brother. Around. Yes. If you it, read the transcript, it's right the there. The transcripts are out there of everything that was said. And then I was misquoted on inside the article, but that's not what I said. We, I'm sincere. I, want I think you guys out. need to make like a public statement telling Brian to turn himself in. I think that would ease a lot of people's. We don't even know if you know. Know. around or he's. Do you think he's dead? No idea. Where does he camp around here? Like where else besides we, Fort so DeSoto? We told I'm sure she's giving yeah, yeah, everything. Everything. When, everything. When you guys were children, where did you, obviously your whole family's outdoors. So when you guys were children, you know, like every summer I went to a place. Where was your summer vacations at normally? Our, we grew up on a great street where our summer vacation was hanging out with our friends. Yeah. So, I mean, we have to. We, we are here for the boat. Petito family. They are suffering bravely. Suffering bravely. Things that you you will never even feel. Hope not. And I it is, it is just, it's just cool right now. You know, having your family uh, destroyed and then the people that you trusted your family member with is ignoring you and hanging up the telephone on you. I understand. I'm in the boat where I'm getting ignored by my family and thrown under the bus by my family's attorney. Why Why would he do that? Like, why? Because Protect his client because she's not their client. So, I'm just as mad. Did they have a storage shed, Gabby? And, um, um, they have a storage locker. Brian, do you know where it was? In, in... I have no idea. Do you know if your, what date your brother flew back that your dad paid for the plane? Didn't even know he paid for the plane. Uh, Did he fly back? Yeah, from, he flew back. Like around like what the seventeenth or something? Put it into their house. Around like the seventeenth or something yeah, after the he fight. Got here on the seventeenth. I don't know what day he left. Did you see him at that on that trip? Yeah. What was discussed? Anything? Was he discussed he was about? They were talking. Or he was telling me where they were going next. I FaceTimed with Gabby and the kids on that trip. I mean. I Did he say he got in a fight with Gabby? No, no. He, didn't, he didn't talk about that incident? That just was surprised to us, too. Yeah. We're unfortunately in the dark as much as everybody else. And more what, was so. your, what was your brother like when he was um, in middle school and a teenager? What was he I like? I didn't live in the house at the time. Has he ever been violent with you? No. Never violent with anybody with brother. i mean me and my sister went I've, at it she pulled my hair <laughs> kicked me in my eye we're, we're eight or nine years apart we're not yeah you're you're old yeah. he's um, not like my we were little right. together brother i mean I was but you guys house. lived in the house at wabasso everybody lived there no my parents lived in new york oh they lived in new york and, you lived in the yeah, house. We we were, in house and then brian and gabby came there they, when they moved down to florida they moved in with us to get on their feet how did they meet jobs. High, High school. school. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I, you know. I feel like I'm answering too many things. Yeah, yeah, I understand. And, and, and I appreciate and respect. Out of respect, we're going to leave. We're going we're, we're gonna to leave. Out of respect, we're going to leave. I don't think, I don't think we're going to be back. And I'm sorry. This is what we wanted. And this. We were told not to come out, but I can't have my kids crying. Well, the fact that you came out. We're not coming back. Yeah, we're, yeah, not, we're not coming back. I mean, back. unless unless you're lying or there's something new, or something, we're not coming back. We're God bless we you guys. No, us too. We just want justice for her. Yeah. We're upset. We're sad. And, and you I'm see, we're we're, we're rational upset. people. We just want That's answers. Fine. We want you just know, closure I, I for Gabby. I would, if I were you, change your strategy because. We don't have strategy. God bless you guys. No, us too. We just want justice for her. We're upset. And, and you see, we're, we're rational people. We just want answers. We want just closure for Gabby. If I were you, change your strategy because... We don't have a strategy. Yeah, they don't even have a lawyer. Gabby deserves better and maybe help, maybe help pressure your parents into doing the right thing because I'm telling you, Gabby's family's suffering bravely and your parents know more than they're, they're letting on and it sounds like they deceived you, which is not... Uh, not good for any parent and I'm just hoping that maybe them, some pressure so. from the family might okay. help them cooperate with law enforcement so we can put an end to this like I got better things to do I'm front <laughs> up I've got chap lips we've yeah, been out there like we've been we've, we've, we've you have a beautiful neighborhood we you, we've been outside your parents home for two weeks we just want answers we want them to come forward and, and share everything they know 
but they refuse to, you know, they just stay silent. They're in their home. Yesterday, they went out gardening in the back of their house, you know, during, you know, Brian's on the loose. They haven't given any public statement saying, hey, Brian, turn yourself in, or you know. help me find my son or, like, nothing. They're outside nothing. gardening. Yeah. Nothing. They're, they're outside just gardening. Like baffled and blown away as everybody It's like, else. you know. Going about our lives, like nothing happened. Do you think, know, have you heard about September 14th where Brian allegedly bought a burner phone at the 18th? From 18th, the, from the yeah. Do you think the, you think his mom was with him? You think your mother? Because That's they said what a, the news says. I don't, know. I don't know what. Brian didn't like a cell phone to begin with. He didn't so. like cell phones. Is he like an outdoorsman? Like what, like what does he like? What's his hobbies? Like does he like do camping like at outdoors? Yeah. And could, do you think? He could survive out in the woods for a month. I think anybody could survive out in the woods for a month if you grab a book and go out there and try. I don't know if I asked before, but do you think he's alive? I hope I don't so. Know. You hope so. Yeah. See, I, hope so I think I think people want him held accountable, but no harm done to him. Yeah, well, of course. You know, we don't want harm done to him. We just want him held accountable for his actions. We would like to give his nephews an answer to when they can see their grandparents again. When you know see their uncle or talk to him or anything. You know, he was their hero, so. I'm, I'm sorry for your guys' pain. You. I'm sorry for you guys' pain. I really am. I'm very sorry, yeah. Sorry, I'm sorry, guys. You guys have a good day. God Thank bless you. you. I hope everything turns out. Keep praying. Thank this all ends, and then everyone can move on and just move forward from here. We need, yeah. to we need to find your brother so we can start uh, I don't start the healing process doing, for the potential. And, and, and again, I we don't condone any violence on your parents. Nope. We've been out there, but we haven't... protesting against violence. We've been out there, but we haven't went on their property. Nope. We don't want anyone doing any damage to their house. We don't want anybody to storm their house. We just want answers. We want them to come forward. You know, hopefully they'll do that. Hopefully, yeah, I, you know, I you know, I'll be honest, I prayed, I prayed, like yeah. I've been praying for the last couple of days saying, I hope they repent and do what's right. Just like I prayed for you guys. I prayed that I'd be able to speak to you guys or you guys would come out and give answers. I prayed for that the last couple of days. I said, you know, and, and this might happen and it did. God bless you guys. And, you know, it's just, it's just hope this gets resolved quickly because, you know, the longer he's out, yeah. it's a danger. I, Thank you. And we are leaving. We are leaving and we're not coming back. I'm not coming back. Thank you. Thank you, Cassie. Thank you. Thank you, Cassie, for your time. We appreciate you. Have a good day. Yep. Thank you. Very powerful. The Cassie Laundry, sister to Brian, uh, James, her husband, came out and talked to us. They came out and talked to us. And I listened to them. And us, we've been outside the laundry house the parents for weeks protesting we're not coming back here we're not coming back here unless something develops that she knows but i will give her the benefit of the doubt for now god bless uh this is patriot activism you know their lawyers were telling them or the i don't know they had advice and said that they weren't supposed to come out and talk to anybody but they did they came out and talked and we kind of got more clarification what was going on so we're out here god bless